Ever notice that the cockpit's magnetic compass isn't on the panel? On most jets, it's up on the ceiling. And the reason is, the panel itself is a giant magnet factory. A magnetic compass is just a magnetized float in liquid, aligning with Earth's magnetic field. But it's so sensitive that even nearby wires, radios and gyros can throw it off. Mounting it higher, away from the avionics bay, keeps it reading clean. That's why you'll see the compass on the glare shield arch or overhead frame, where magnetic noise is weaker. During certification, engineers actually switch every system on and record the deviation, publishing a compass correction card so pilots know what to expect. Even in a glass cockpit jet with GPS and inertial systems, regulations still demand a direct reading magnetic compass. The nickname, the Whiskey Compass, because early versions were filled with alcohol to dampen the ball's movement. It's simple, but it never dies. Yes, it has errors. Dip errors, turning errors, acceleration quirks. But that little instrument above your head is the ultimate fallback. If every screen goes dark, Earth's magnetic field will still point you home. So, which do you trust more? The old school whiskey compass on the ceiling, or the digital navigation displays it quietly outlives? Gravity and magnetism, or code and screens?